If somebody's trying to hack your network and they go after How do you hack into a computer network to bring it down or steal data? That's what these students are learning. The idea is that if they can think like hackers, they'll be able to defend their networks more effectively and ultimately catch cyber attackers. Uh, we find out that someone hacked into a system. Well, then you go and you look at your logs. You go and you do... It, it's, a, it's a detective work, and it, but you're working backwards. Somebody's already done something bad. Ideally, we want to place ourselves in a position where we go, aha, here they come in. And so that takes, that takes a lot of tenacity. A study last year by the Ponemon Institute found that the number of cyber attacks on U.S. companies has more than doubled since 2009. Organizations are now keen to hire qualified technicians, but demand is outstripping supply. Benny, who's 22, used to want to be an actor or a musician. But in the wake of the financial crisis, he's decided to go for a career with more solid employment prospects. It is really cool to be able to protect your network hacking into somebody else's and be able to do all those little things that you can do. But at the same time, money is a growing issue in this country, so I feel like this is something that's going to be able to have me know that I have a secure job and that I'll always be able to financially support myself. Some estimates see cybersecurity adding tens of thousands of jobs to the US economy in the coming years, and Benny hopes to have a wealth of options when he graduates. One problem for the industry is that despite the new wave of courses, cybersecurity still has an image problem when it comes to attracting students. There's only so many people that I think have the passion to do this kind of work, because a lot of other people who have passions for computers are developing games and really cool applications and, and it's, it's wonderful, uh, it, it's, it's benefiting all of us, but we need more people who have a passion for thinking about the security and how we can protect those, those games and those applications from, from the adversaries. Some of these students will soon be on the front line of cybersecurity. It'll be down to them to make sure that hackers are completely locked out.